Following up on another story from last week, uh, very quickly, the uh, the thirty thousand dollars worth of NBA Elite copies, the five copies of NBA Elite Eleven uh, on eBay, didn't sell Ben. No. And, and I, 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 I don't think either of us are surprised at thirty thousand dollars. That's a down payment on a house or something. <laughs> People are probably uh, video, big video game collectors with a lot of money are probably not looking at basketball video games. So thirty thousand dollars was a little bit ambitious. There is another copy on there going for forty, uh, not forty thousand, rather four thousand US. <laughs> um, there's a case going for about four hundred or so. Uh, the the thirty thousand dollar listing has not been relisted at this time as of this recording. And as I said, the other one for four thousand. I don't know if that's going to sell either because I know a lot of the older games do go for a lot simply because they are rare and hard to get hold of and it is a collector's item being an, an unreleased game that's leaked out into the public. But the whole controversy over Elite 11 and the fact that it's such a niche title, you know, basketball gaming is a niche interest within uh, you know, the video gaming hobby. Yeah, I just don't see Ben going for 4000 A couple of hundred, yes. 4000 no. Yeah, uh, I think you'd be lucky if you got 1000 Yeah. But, uh, well, well, I guess we'll see. The copies are still going up, but uh, as long as it's 4000 US, it's out of my price range, so I won't be <laughs> not picking it up myself. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely the same in that, in that boat at the moment. So, But uh, once again, if EA would like to donate a couple of copies, we'll uh, be glad to forward our, our home addresses to, for postage. <laughs> so, well, I'll even pay for the postage, so there you go. Yeah. <laughs> it's, my, it's my kind offer. Yeah. <laughs> 